You must be very stupid to raise your voice at me. Let rest that nonsense. Eh? Look at you. You are out of this house for a week. You go out, you come in any time at your own will. And when I call you to ask you questions, you walk out of me. Are you crazy? Why would you call me? Are you me? stupid? I am not stupid, actually. I am not. Why would you be asking me for three to five million naira? Where do you expect me to get that kind of money from? I open the business for you. What you know? I, I single-handedly sponsor this business for you. Oh, okay, God, if you like double-handedly open the business, when you opened it, it was a kiosk. Now it's a boutique. And How I much did I put in that business? What did you put in? How much? You're asking me where I'm going to. How I much did I put money. in that business? Where do you want me to get money from? No, I will go outside, open my legs and bring the money back to you. Where do you want me to get money from? I go outside also. What men like you do is what a lady is doing. Exactly what I'm doing, actually. If you want to kill yourself, kill yourself! You must be stupid by talking to me anyhow. Are you crazy? Remember what I told you when I took you from your parents? I told you that I'm going to treat you like a queen. And that's exactly what I'm doing right now. You have been treating me more than a queen. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I told you I'm going to spoil you. <laughs> Thank you very much. I love everything. It's your special day, so I suppose to honor it. Okay. I have a surprise for you. Uh, actually, you got me something already. Yeah. What are you buying again? It's okay. Come on. Over here. Okay. Are we going upstairs, outside, out of the compound? You know now, I'm in charge, so you follow me anywhere I take you. Thank you! Thank you! Thank you so much! 
This is amazing. This is so <laughs> Oh my god, and it's my best color. I love this. Yeah. I know what you like. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god. This is beautiful. Do you like it? What? I love it. Uh, yeah, you know what you like. Thank you so much. Thank you. I appreciate this from the bottom of my heart. Yeah. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Thank you. over 100 million naira in a twinkle of an eye for nobody, for somebody I know nothing about. to somebody you know nothing about. He charmed me. I believe that man charmed me. Because hi hey, Ajolo cannot cannot make such a mistake. It is not possible. It is not possible. Hey. He's he said me ghost what of two millionaire. I saw the ghost. I made profit. I sent him back his money. He sent me goose again. He repeated itself. I sent him back his money. And... He must be an agent from the pit of hell. <sighs> so one day he told me that his company is doing promotions. That I should invest 100 million. They will give me additional goods worth 100 million, making it 200 million. And I did. I had to go and borrow money from the bank. Hi. I had to call some of my friends to collect money from them. Up to now, this guy is not picking my calls. I don't know where to find him. I don't know what to do. You should have told me you do not have such amount of money. I told him. I told him, he insisted that I might not be able to have this opportunity again. I did. Where do I get all that million to pay back? Eh? Where, do I, where do I get all that million to pay back? I'm finished too. Mama, you are not finished, okay? The downfall of a man is not the end of his life. Mm -hmm. Hundred million is a lot of money. Yes. But I assure you, some way God will fix it. Mm -hmm. Okay? So where do I get hundred million? How do I get money to pay back? Where? You know the way banks, you know the way they do that. I don't care, but it's okay. It's okay, Andrew. Please, don't cry. As long as my husband is still alive, you will never go back to square one. Please, to have a high blood pressure, please. Andrew, it's fine. Hey, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Ibrahim! Ibrahim! 
Hurry up. Yes. Um, take this money. Go to the market and get me some fresh fruits. Go to Ogba Market. Too. Don't go to that junction. Is that clear? Your transport is included here. I know you like trekking. Uh, but that's okay. You can trek because you're not doing anything for now. So you can trek. That would be nice. Here's the money. But go to Ogba Market. Don't go to that junction. Make sure you lock the gates while leaving. Back. He's not supposed to be back by now. Hey. What do I do now? Huh? You're asking me? You need to leave now because if he sees you here, he's going to shoot both of us. Hey, God. Hello? Mr. Hartman, I, I will be there in five minutes. Just give me five minutes. Yes. You're always in a haste. Five minutes is good. Just give me like five minutes. I'll come. Yes. Bros, give me five minutes. Give me five minutes. to worry about. Hi, come on, darling. <laughs> of course I know I'll do that. Yes, yes, yes. Well, that is why I love you, baby. You have nothing to worry about, trust me. Bro. What's up? It was God that saved me today. Uh, hey. Let me let me call you back, Dad. Let me call you back. Hey. What are you talking about? What happened? Bro. So the narrow escape. Bro. Narrow escape from narrow what? Narrow escape. From what? Hey, bro. Eh? What's happening now? What's going on? We know the cut him today. We are the best. What? Hey! How? You know that regular woman that you see? Uh huh. That's my regular woman now. Hey! It is today I found out the real meaning of Larry Escape. I was with her now in her bedroom with a bench. With a bench. All of a sudden, we heard a car home. Guess what? Her husband. Well, the bench. Um, 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 how I take escape, I can't even explain. One thing I just I knew is that one second I was in the house, the other second I was outside. That was how that was how God saved me. My friend, stop calling God in this. Stop calling God for not using your head. What do you mean? How can you be calling God when it was you who went to, to another man's matrimonial bed to sleep with his wife? She was the one that called me now. Even when I was giving her reasons. Why I can't come? If I give one reason, I receive one alert. If I give two, I receive two alert. She sent me an irresistible amount of money. So how much did she send to you, if I may ask? She sent me 200,000 Naira 
for one hour. Not one game, one hour. See, it's what the risk of. Ha, it's more than the risk, sir. Now I see why you've been stupid. Hmm? Now I know why you've been very stupid and careless with your life. See, let me tell you, stupid or not, see this job. This job, I am taking this job as my professional job. I am now a professional venture. Even if there's a place I will go and get license, I will go and get it. I'm not. I am now a professional venture. We die here. Don't worry, I can attest to that. But I advise you to be very careful. If not, you lose your life on the line. Be very careful with this. See, I, the way you are advising me, if someone comes to that, they will think you are, you are a pastor or something. Oh, but this job rentals for you. Don't you categorize me anymore. I'm not part of this anymore, please. Fine. <laughs> you are calling someone's wife. You are one and only. You are calling someone's wife your personal property. This is the same job we are doing. All of us, we there for this same job. Ah, we see the job. Ah, you are even a senior in the job. I'm just a cadet. Ah. shadow of your own self. The only thing you do is drink. Drink away your life. Think about your glory days and, and let your own life waste. What is your problem? So what do you want me to do? You want to know what you should do. I'll tell you. in the bar. Make sure you have enough money to buy more drinks because I will not spend the time to buy more drinks. It's looking like I'm deliberately buying drinks for you to continue drinking and drinking your life away. Actually, men fall, but they rise. But your own case, mm -mm. it seems the ground you fell on has become so comfortable and soft for you that you have forgotten to rise. Get a life. You will not continue like this. she's treating you the way she is. I pampered this woman. I pampered her. I make sure she got all she asked. Her. 
her sudden change. For her being a nightmare in my life is one question I keep asking myself. Please, Angelo. Just give her some time. I'm sure she will change. Please forgive her. No. She will not. She will. She is a woman. The love is not there. So let me tell you something. When a woman loves a man, whatever he does, she will overlook it. But when you don't, Stay that way now. She will not. You're right. I completely understand. I can feel your pain. I know how you're feeling right now. But please, just take it easy. Take it easy on yourself, please. Everything will be fine. You will bounce back. Please, Adjolo. Excuse me. Let me call my husband. Stronger than it has time inside it is I don't understand. What are you trying to say? My wife. My wife has used my head as a comfortable chair. She sits up at work. You probably said that, so what do you want me to do about it? I want to start business, anything, no matter how little, so that the insult will reduce. You've always said that too. So how do I come in? And what do you want me to do? Okay, I need you to help me. I need money. I need money. Please. Okay. I will transfer a hundred thousand naira to your account. Yes, 100,000 right away to your account. 100,000? One million one. I mean, what would 100,000 do? It's business that I want to start. What would I do with 100,000? When you started your own business, did you use 100,000 to start your own business? This is somebody that wants millions before them. So why give him a hundred thousand? You see, Adjolo, I've always given you money. But you see, you keep coming back to ask for more. What would I do with a hundred thousand? You know for real that you and my wife cannot tell your source a story without mentioning my name. You know the role I played. Have I abandoned you? Did I ever abandon you at any point? Is it yeah, because each time you come here, I assist you. Why are you trying to, you know, blackmail me like you helped me and I forgot about it and I stopped. I didn't I didn't assist you. No, no, that's a reason. It's not, a point. it's not a point of abandoning me or not. There's a reason why I come here. What would I do with 100,000? That's, that's the question. 100,000, are you AJ making? Actually, I cannot fall for your cheap blackmail. Trust me. Oh, yeah. If you came here to blackmail me, you failed. If I have briefed blackmail, this is not blackmail. The question is, 
A hundred thousand is it for what? You are the one blackmailing yourself. like the way you spoke to your brother. It is very wrong. I mean, you know what he's going through right now. Were you not here the last time he came to ask for help? I gave him 50,000 naira. He complained. Now I have doubled it like times two. And he's still complaining. Can't you see? He likes complaining. Baby, do you know your brother used to be a millionaire? A multi-millionaire? I mean, giving him 50,000, 100,000 naira. Like seriously, that's not what he really wants from you. You sound like I have never assisted him. When this guy lost his business, I gave him five million naira to bounce back to business. If he was somebody that is focused, he would have used that money, turned it over and go back to business. But what did he do? He went and came back with a story. Now the bank he was owing took the money from him. Can you imagine that kind of nonsense talk? My brother has all of a sudden gone feeble. Babe, he has lost it. He has no business idea anymore. Babe. So giving him money is a waste of money. It's an exercise in futility. Baby, can you calm down? You're talking to me, your wife, not your brother. Just calm down. You, you, you're taking it too hard. You're taking it too harsh, really. But you can do something for him. I don't know what you want me to do. Like empty my bank account into his? No, honey. No, maybe that's what you wanted to do. No. Maybe you have enough, but he doesn't even have nothing. I give him five million. Gone. Even if I give this guy ten million naira, he will still come back with stuff. He will not. You see only a lecker. Baby, he will not. Just do something for him, honey. Seriously, it's a good keep us out. to go out. You told me that before. You said that a few minutes ago. Yeah, um, because I went outside there to start the car. I noticed that uh, there's no fuel inside that car. So... Why sell fuel? Why are you telling me? There's a full station down the road. You can go there and fill up it. It's enough. Ah. I'm trying to see if I will, if I will call us a man. You see that thing you want to say? Swallow it. Don't even open your mouth and say that thing you want to say. Please. Why? 
Is there anything wrong in me asking you for money to put fuel in the car? Hi. Hi, Achuluk. Shame on you. Shame on you. Achuluk, the only thing that happened is that you failed in business. Small business that you were handling, you failed. You lost your business and to stand up on your feet again has been a problem for you. Despite the support your brother and I have been giving to you. What more do you want? Every day you sit down in the house, you balance, spread on my chair like malaria. Wait for me to give you money. But you know, where have you kept your sense of shame? Where? What? Shame how? Yes, I know that I will do something about my financial state that I'm really facing now. But I shouldn't be ashamed of asking my wife for money. I mean, we are, we are one. Chilo, you should be ashamed though. You should be. Moreover, we are not one. Our placenta were not tied together when they gave birth to us. Really? You came to this world differently and I came differently. We are not one. What are you teaching your son? That he should depend on his wife when he gets married. Is that what you're doing? Hi! You have lost it though. You have lost it. You want to ask for money, you put your hand in your pocket. Acting like you gave me money to keep somewhere for you that you want to collect. Actually, you have lost it. Find yourself in our chain. Don't let that money kill you. For money, shameless man. The worst that can happen to any man is to marry a wrong woman. You'll be in hell without dying. Okay. What a wrong sin card. Gorgeous. Hello. How are you? I'm good. Mm. <laughs> the most beautiful woman I know. So tell me, did you dream of me last night? Did I dream of you last night? Um, no. But I'll tell you something more amazing. This past few days without you, it's been like a thousand years in hell. I missed you. Oh, now I want to eat you up. Hmm? You really want to? Yes. But I don't want you to say those words anymore. I want to see you in action. Very well then. Let me take you to paradise. You know that amazing experience you gave to me? <laughs> I want to feel it. Daddy, Daddy, Daddy. Mm. Dad, Mom, good afternoon. Boy. Good afternoon. How are you? Fine, and you? Oh, good. Okay. Go and remove your screen uniform and then have your food, eh? Okay, Dad. Good. <laughs> Dad, you're worried. I'm not worried. Yes, that's not the normal you. The normal you, you play with me and take me upstairs. Ah. Ah. Are you not my boy again? Mm. Give me five. Mm. Again. Mm. Again. Mm. Again. Mm. Again. Mm. 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 Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> <laughs>
I'm thinking of something different. Something different? Over there. Come. <laughs> yeah. She you know you're crazy. Shut up. <laughs> it makes me want to keep going and going and going. Are you sure you want to go? <laughs> of course, always, darling. Do you want to go more? Yes. I love your energy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's go. I'm getting ready for school. I don't want him to miss the school bus. Did you say good morning to me? Hmm? Did you even ask me how I slept last night? I should ask you how you slept last night. So you have become the woman in this house that now seeks attention. That is what she wants. I should ask you how you slept. Why would I ask you how you slept? For what? You should even be lucky that you did not sleep in the bush. You want to know? Come on, come and see the answer here. Leia, come and take the answer. I should ask you how. Please go and wake Junior up and dress him up for school. I'm all rich. This house. Yes, Grandma. Don't worry, I'm here. I will cook a lubu soup. They will, they will, they will not fight <laughs> again. <laughs> ah, Mama, you are here. Ah, Gina, tell the informer to give you mango in the back. Informer! Oh. Yes, Grandma. 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 Yes, Grand
Yes, Give me a mango. Run, run. I got the big ones. Uh -huh. Mama, you, you never told me that you were coming. I thought you were going to my brother's house. We talked. Get kids talk to the river. That I will come to the city. I will not come to your place for then I will go to your brother's house. What kind of talk is that? Okay, you're not you're not happy. If I'm mm. a uh, Mama now, uh uh, I was only joking now. Why are you joking? Look at your face, you're not even happy that can you, can you, you're not happy to see me or what? Mama was yours, please. Don't let that kind of joke because where is your wife? She's not back uh, from market. Oh. Mm, she's not yet back from the market. Yeah, what is going on? I thought you two have made peace with each other. I thought you've arranged, you've, you've settled your family. Can you imagine me? Um, Mama, ever since my business collapsed, you see, this is my wife that all of you used to praise me for. Eh? She completely changed. She does not have respect anymore. She talks to me anyhow. She even thinks that I'm a piece of garbage. Oh, mom. You are not a piece of garbage. Oh? No. We women were like that at times. Uh, uh, Mama, Ajela, uh, tell me the truth. What effort have you put in place to regain your business? I mean, to, to get money, to take control of this family again. So can't I own a home? if I don't have money. Answer me, Mama. Can't I own a home if I don't have money in my pocket? Can't I own a home? Eh? When Daddy was finding things difficult, Mama, don't you respect him? Why can't my wife do the same thing? Ajilu, we are different. I am your mother. She's your wife. Women are different and we handle things differently. Eh? What, what I can endure, she might not be able to endure. You want to go? Different understanding. Because, but, but you're supposed to have known this. Really, are you? During the time of courtship, you should have known her flaw before you married her. Eh? No matter what it is, try and get another business, start another thing. Kill a motor very ego, small money. Eh? You see, when there's no money in a man's hand, oh, we can want a fair. Oh, we go to be small. It should be okay. Don't oh, try. I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying my best. It's okay. Try harder. No problem, Mama. What? Come, come, let's go inside. It's okay, Mama. Come. Let's go inside. is not yet back up to now. Hmm? What could she be doing out there by this time of the night? Huh? It's very wrong for a married woman to be outside her house at this hour of the night. Why the husband is at home? What do you man? I've called her. I've called her. She says she's on her way. She's on her way for over two hours now. Eh? I don't like it at all. Huh? How can a woman be out the husband is at home? Go drag home here. Thank God. Thank God it's happening in your presence. If I talk now, you people say I talk too much. I used to complain. 
somebody's wife. Hi, man. Ajuluchu, you are my son. And you are the man of this house. It's time you, you tell your wife what you want and what you don't want. Stand peace for all here. You're the man of this house. Take authority of the house. Mama, I know why I'm saying all this, Enzo. Because I will not take this nonsense, so. I will not take this evil act from anybody. Because it's getting out of hand. I'm about to lose it, oh. I'm about to lose it. I'm sick, I'm tired of enduring this evil act. I will not take it. She's somebody's wife. I'm a long police here. No one case, I know why. So if you, are, you want to talk to her, you better talk to her because I'm, 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 this, it's getting out of hand. I will not take this nonsense. Though. It's never, it's never sweet. It has its ups and downs. You see, when you are in the down mode, the down period, you should be careful with what you say or do in order not to stop that good time from coming again. It goes up and it comes down. Just like you have morning and night. Ajilum, I'm not in last forever. Oh? Thank you. I'm happy that this is coming up from your mouth. This is the same thing you're trying to explain to her for her to understand. But it seems very difficult for her to understand. I'm not talking to her alone. I'm also talking to you. Mom, learn to control your feelings. Your beautiful wife here is working so hard to fend for this family. So, overlook her flaws and encourage her. Mama, yeah, Mom. If my wife is sitting here because she's feeding my home, we make her to be suspected. Then let her stop. Uh, Please, Mama. because I won't take it. Actually, Mama, have you seen it? Have you seen it? I do everything possible to make him comfortable. He never appreciates anything I do. If you want me to stop working and sell off my business, I will. I will sell off the business and sit with you in the house if that is what you want. Mm -mm. If that is what you want. Hey, no. Please stop shedding me. Making my family think that I'm not and I'm treating you badly. What nonsense. Eh? What am I even demanding from you? Respect, respect me as your husband, not treat me like, like a husband. Ajulu is enough. Ajulu, do you realize you're talking to a woman? Eh? Be careful. What is it? Pamper her. Oh. Yes, Mama Munya Mukawa. I can see you're supporting her, Mama. Just like my brother. But you know one thing I'll tell you, really. by the time you people will see her true attitude, you will live to regret every bit of it. Ajulu Shuku! Ajulu! Have you seen it? Have you seen it? This is what I have to go through every day in this house. I try my best to make everything fine in this house, but he doesn't appreciate it at all. What does he want me to do? Stop crying. He will be fine. Oh, Biko, stop crying. Oh, I'm tired. Oh, please don't be. I'm tired. This is not fair. It's not fair at all. It's not fair. This is family. It's marriage. Huh? Okay, make up another thing. Oh, mom. Biko, Biko. It's okay. It will be fine.
my brother. My beloved brother. One name. Please, do not turn your deaf ear to me. I want you to help me. Be gone. If possible, lend me money. I will pay you back. Please, help me. Your brother needs to bounce back again. Please. Um, like how much do you want me to lend you? Okay, um, 10 million or 5 million would be okay for me. Please. I still have my customers intact. And they are waiting for me to come back in, in the market. Please help me. Just do it for me. Mm -hmm. See, I'm good. When it comes to business, I'm good. I'm good. I'm very, very good. Before you know it, I will bounce back immediately without wasting time. Be cool. Mm -hmm. Well, the truth of the matter is that I don't have money. Yeah. I will not make this city now. You don't have money. Hmm. See, I'm about to lose it. I know you wouldn't want me to die. But I'm about to lose it. I'm about to lose it. Please, just help me. Please. I do not want to be gone. I can be see. I'll be able to see people. I do. Why don't you try something else? You see, this life is if you try here, it doesn't work. You try here. Why don't you just go learn some handiwork, right? I mean, there are so many things to learn. Because for me, I would rather give you money to start up after learning a particular handiwork than risking my money. And all in the name of you want to bounce back, you want to start business again. It had all their work. Why can't I do a business? Okay. Okay, if okay, since you're insisting I should go and learn and work. What do you want me to do? What do you want me to learn? There is tailoring, there is mechanic, there is a carpenter. The man has work. Two of you here more. You see, I've I've seen people who made it from your own. Yes. Uh huh. I'm a normal, normal mechanic. Oh, first to rebuild it, mechanic. So in this work, I just want to build a huge cable. I bought some. We need to get it in ego. Think it now. So we'll work on that soon. Ah, hello. All of my nice work. Coco, okay. I just want to. Consider what I'm telling you. I, I got a feeling. I'm, you know, don't try to misunderstand me. I don't know what I'm feeling. No, that's not what I'm doing. But I'm just like trying to, you know, be on the same page with you. Years ago. Oh, the man. Oh, the man. Be gone. Baby, 
from the tone of your brother's voice, I can feel his pain. I can feel, I can, I can feel blood dripping through his heart. Baby, please, why not help him one more time? Thank God you said one more time. At least you acknowledge the fact that I've been helping him. I'm putting close to 10 million naira supporting this man. And every day comes back with a new story. Baby, I understand. But would you prefer he dies? No, 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 no. Maybe you would prefer he draws me down. Yes. Maybe in a region I can or dot walk in a million if he doesn't know how to swim. But that's what you want. Will I keep myself for him? Baby, please. Uh, Baby, I completely understand. Baby, it's me. I want to talk to you. I want us to talk. Come and sit down here. You can say what it is you have to say. I can hear you. Sit down. you to help me with some money I need to start up a business so that by the time the business start working again and then I will pay you back the money how much are we looking at we're looking at um, about three to five million Bara Jesus I cannot hear you clearly. Yeah? What did you say? No, I, I want to hear you clearly. How much did you say you want? I said three to five. Can you say? Three to what? I'm asking you how to do. Three to what? If they give you three million or five million, would you be able to count it? Do you know what you're asking me to do? You are literally asking me to shut down my business. Give you the money to start up a business we don't even know if you will handle well. What happened to the other businesses you had? You couldn't handle small businesses. I should give you three, three to five million naira. There is something wrong with you upstairs. There is something wrong with you upstairs, actually. Look, look at the man. They gave me three to five million naira. You can even pronounce it. And I'm sure you can't count it. And let me tell you, I am going on a business trip tomorrow. Come back here. Come back here. What, what's what, what you, yes, come back. What's it? What's, what's your problem? Hey! Why are you why are you working out on B? You want to know what my problem is? Yes, what's your problem? You want to know what you I will tell you what my problem is. My problem is you. You are my problem. How dare you? What are you asking me for? Three to five million. Where do you expect me to get that kind of money from? I'm asking you, where? You must be very mad. You must be very stupid to raise your voice at me. I'm that nonsense. Eh? Look at you. 
You are out of this house for a week. You go out, you come in any time at your own will. And when I call you to ask you a question, you walk out of me. Are you crazy? Why would you call me? Are you stupid? Me? I am not stupid, actually. I am not. Why would you be asking me for three to five million naira? Why do you expect me to get that kind of money from? I you open huh? a business for you. What you know? I, I single-handedly sponsor this business for you. Oh, guy, if you like double-handedly open the business, when you opened it, it was a kiosk. Now it's a boutique. And How I much did I put in that business? What did you put in? How much? You're asking me where I'm going to. How I'm much did I put in that business? Where do you want me to get money from? No, I will go outside, open my legs and bring the money back to you. Where do you want me to get money from? I go outside also. What men like you do is what a lady is doing. Exactly what I'm doing, Atulu. If you want to kill yourself, kill yourself! You must be stupid by talking to me anyhow. Are you crazy? Who can back to you? Are you mad? Are you mad? How dare you talk back, talk, talk, talk back at me? You must be stupid! You waste your hands. And if one more, if you come close to me, I'll beat the hell out of you. You mean Ajulu Chukri laid his hands on you? Exactly what I said. I am tired. I am sick and tired of your brother. I just simply went on a business summit. I came back, he inquired where I went to. I told him everything. And the next thing he started asking me for three to five million naira. I told him I didn't have that kind of money. Honestly, I don't have that kind of money. Before I could say Jack Ajulu bounced on me and beat the living daylight out of me. Where did I go wrong? What did I do wrong to your brother? I'm tired. I'm tired. I won't keep up with this. I cannot keep up with this. Every day I go out, I work, I hustle just to make sure that everybody is fine in the house. I do everything to make him comfortable. All he does is sit, eat and beat me whenever he chooses. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? How am I supposed to continue living with Ajulu like that? How? I'm tired. I can't keep up with this. I can't keep up with this. <laughs> hey, what's that? <laughs> Could you believe that woman called me? I said I got her pregnant. Are you trying to tell me you don't sleep with people's wives without protections? How you talk like this now? And they got a sweet spots now. Oh no. Now why are you talking like you're sick in the head? What if she's got an STD? How can a healthy woman like that have STD? Huh? What are you talking? Now I see you're mad. You're trying to tell me now STD respects wealth. See, I've always told you, okay? Your problem is that every time you're always conscious of sickness, sickness that STD this. Huh? See, let me tell you, it's only what you're conscious of that comes to you. Me, yeah, I'm not conscious of all this rubbish. Like, what I know now to go bench, if I bench, I'll, 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 go, I'll, go, I'll go fall out. You know what yes, yes, darling. I know, I know. I, I told them yesterday. Yes, don't worry, don't worry. I'll, I'll uh, put, put that to an end. I'll walk towards that, I promise. Okay, darling. I'll talk to you soon. Bro, you've got to be very careful. You have to be very careful. I tell you. See, bro, there is nothing to be worried about. Even her husband found out and sent her out of the house. So I don't even stand the risk of her husband coming after me. So what are you talking about? What they drink, I so now that she's pregnant, what are you going to do about it? What am I going to do about it? Do I look like a pregnancy doctor? I've blacklisted a number in my phone. So onto the onto the next one. Ah, uh, uh, that was that one more important. I will talk now. The next client. Will be late. Hello. So, uh, <laughs> you have not 
nothing to worry about, of course. We are very happy. Because ever since I got to the city, God has been so faithful. You can say that again. It is written all over you. Eh? And the things you bought for me, it's a proof that God has blessed you. Eh? And my God is not asleep. <laughs> you can say that again, Mama. You can say that again. <laughs> hey, Mama, I remember you were owing a lot of money. Uh, Mama, you know what I want you to do? Uh, I want you to make a list of everyone you owe in this village. Okay, I should write mm -hmm. them down, eh? Right? Yes. Okay. If possible, get me the account numbers. Uh, I will dump money in the account and then settle the bills. Oh! I don't know. Hey, I am not I go to the I go to the Eh, You just uh, came in. Barely few months that you left this place and you are splashing all this uh, uh, money all over the place. What kind of job do you actually do in that city? Mama, why is Papa like this now? Huh? Why is Papa an enemy of progress? <laughs> Papa, I came back here to rejoice with my family. That God has blessed me. Why are you attacking me like you? You don't want me to progress in this life. I am not a small boy. If you think I am, you know your father very well. I am not a small boy. And I won't just be accepting everything that you, you bring to this place and pretend that I'm happy. What kind of job do you do? Eh? No, what is it? Why are you standing like this? Eh? Why can't you appreciate what God is doing in the life of your son? Eh? Your son, Gara City. Go, you went there and put the leak and Instead of you appreciating eh? you are eating Nandiko. Allow him to have peace for coming back home. What kind of job do you do in the city, Chukwenaka? Okay, Papa. If you must know. I want to know. I am now the managing director of one of the biggest oil firms in the city. <laughs> you are now a managing director? Yes, Papa. Now. Uh, in, in an oil company? Yes. Just barely a few months ago that you, you left. Don't you believe in miracles? You are now a managing director? Okay, Michael, don't, don't play. This is your father. Don't forget that I worked at five years before I retired. Mm. And nobody just comes from the top. Everybody starts from the bottom and get to the top. Papa don't believe in God, though. Oh, yeah. Our God is a miracle God. That is how it happened. He can turn no protocols, Papa. He can turn oh. your night to day, turn your day to night. Anyhow, you oh. want it. That is how I'm here. You should celebrate with me, Papa, not, not uh, argue with me and ask me silly questions. Well, no, no, congratulations. Hi. Congratulations in your in your mm. achievement. Mm. Thank you very much. Papa. But don't forget who you are. Uh. Good name is better than gold. Uh. Don't forget it. Look at my your mother. Look at myself. Don't forget us. Don't forget to. Mama, people bring it here. Bring it here. Oh, yeah, bring it here. Yes. Hey, I don't know. Yeah, oh, yes. Hey, oh, I My brother, you sound as if you are never going to bounce back again. Ajulu, I know you are a very intelligent businessman. You will definitely bounce back. Trust me. Reminds me. What about your brother? I know he's worthy enough to give you at least like 50 million euros 
to make you bond back to your feet. My Why will you say so? Moreover, it's your brother. I believe there have to be a way out. You can't just remain like this. It's okay. When the owner are done bad, and you say what you mean, I don't But I have to go. You know, my boy is only one at two. I need to go home and do it. Are you for real? Where is your wife? Traveling for one business, the other, you know. One day, my eyes have seen the You bring this new experience, your kisses, the way you touch me. Everything is beautiful. Let me ask you, who are you? I mean, where did you learn all this from? <laughs> well, everything I knew today about bed matics. I learned from you. Oh, please shut up and start talking already. I'm not joking. Where did you learn this from? But I'm serious. I mean, every time I look at your beautiful body, so many things start to play in my head. Hmm. I mean, like right now, I just wish I could kiss him <laughs> and lick you. Lick you from head to toe. <laughs> and make you scream down the heavens. Because all I want is your happiness at the end. Thank you. Another beautiful thing is, is the impact. I mean, I love 
of the impact of being in your arms. I could feel that muscle, the way you grab it, hold me. I mean, it's, it's out of this world. Oh, yeah? You are one beautiful tree with amazing flowers. I love you, darling. You sure you love me? Very sure. You sure you love me? You sure you love the sound of that? <laughs> Without telling your husband you're going out. Hey. Huh? Hello? <laughs> no, no. I thought we talked about this. Listen, I just only got to my house. What do you want me to pray about it? <sighs> <laughs> you have a way with words, trust me. Alright, it's okay. I'm, I'm, I'm letting you back. See you like another 10 minutes. I'm talking to you. Where are you going? Why are you shouting? You're asking me where I'm going. I'm going to fly a helicopter. You think I would sit at home like you do every day, doing nothing with your life? Do I look idle to you? No, I am asking you. Do I look idle to you? Mr. Man, I work. I hustle. That is exactly what I am going to do. Send me these stupid questions. Again. Do you realize who you're talking to? Do you realize who you're talking to? Ajulu Chuku Chuku Jeku. No, 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 please, please, keep quiet. What are you saying? Now you want to start reminding me of how you made your first 20 million at the age of 20. Eh? I should start clapping for you. Money you made how many years ago? See your mates. Look at what they are doing. No, look at the hands you use in making those money. They're still hanging on your shoulders, and I'm very certain they are way stronger than it was then. But the brain you use in making the money, what is it? Did you throw it away? I am asking, did you? You're asking me, you're telling me nonsense. Am I the one that changed your life? Am I the one that changed you from who you used to be? Go and walk on. Go and make money. Do something with your life. I get time before no be property. Bala, open the gates. Yes, madam. I know what you're going through is not really easy. But you're just trying to calm yourself down. Well, you see, since the last time we met, I've been thinking. What could be the solution to this your problem? Do you still have the contact of those white men that used to produce goods for you? Yes, I, I still have it. Now, bless time, I've been to China. Okay. What about those contacts? I mean, 
those that you used to say you boost to, do you still have their contact? Yes, sure. I still have their contact. I suggest you sell your land at Onicha. Use the money to build up yourself again. So, I mean, you expect me to, to sell that? The only land left for me? That's crazy. You see, I don't expect you to agree with me immediately. All I want you to do, go home, sleep over it. Every day, I see you grieving away days from your life. Think of selling that land or leave it and remain where you are. I'm sorry, but I, I don't have a choice but to call. I, I need some money. I don't have any time on me anymore. You to lie to me it's right now. It's not what I think, it is what I heard. You just told the girl over the phone that you love her. Really? What? How, how the hell am I supposed to do that? Why would I do that? Ken, you don't have to lie to me. I heard you. You told the girl over the phone that you love. How can you be this ungrateful? What is wrong with you? Babe, it's not what you think. Can I have the phone? Can I have the phone? A phone I bought with my money? You told the girl that you love her under the phone and you stand there to tell me that it's not what I think? So you mean I cannot tell my mother that I love her anymore? Or maybe I cannot tell my sister I love her? Or I can tell my brother too? Why are you like this? I came here so you don't feel jealous of the way I communicate with my family. Yet, you are here accusing me of cheating on you. Darling, I was working before you met me. You asked me to leave the job, I left the job, and you brought me down to this place I know nothing about. And now you do not want me to talk to anybody? Not even my family? Gosh. I'm tired of all this. See? I'm tired of all this. You should have just answered the call here. It got me suspicious when you picked up the phone and and left to take the call outside. Well, that's because you were sleeping here. I didn't want to disturb you. By the way, you still feel jealous if I tell my mom right before you that I love her. You know how to be. Okay. I'm sorry. I promise I won't do it again. No, I don't trust you. I'm sure you do. Very sure of that. Ken, I just said I am sorry. Please, I won't do it again. I promise. Hmm? Are you sure of all this? Yes, I'm sure. <laughs> I think someone's smiling. <laughs> Very well, then, can I have my phone? Oh. Uh
Oh, it's cold. It's okay. It's um, it's fine. So um, you My actually phone. want your phone? Okay. You think you can get the phone? You sure you want the phone? Darling. Come get the phone. Come get. <laughs> Oh, darling. <laughs> Baby. Mm. You know I'm going to be lonely without you. And you know I wouldn't want to leave because I would be lonely as well. But I have to get back to business. Else my workers will loot my shop. Okay? Now I can't wait to see you again. <laughs> oh. I can't wait to see you too, but I have to go. All right? Mm. So, I will call you when I'm done for the I have to get to the shop and um, don't forget to call me if you need anything. Of course, I'll call right? you. I take care, darling. All right. Bye. Bye. to tell you that I'm sick and tired of Susan. I will not tolerate her anymore again. I will first report to her parents. After that, I will bundle her back to her parents' house. Bam, 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 bam. It's not like that. Hey, well, what did she do this time? She's not treating me like a trash. What nonsense is that? I got her For Susan to, 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 to lay her hands on me? Hey! Mama, I will not take it. I will not take it. Hey. Enough of that nonsense. But then, Mama, it, it might be that you, you get, you, Press Mama, so please stop, 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 stop all the other Sam. I'm not pressure, remember the What is pressure? Me. Mama, please stop telling me that. Please. If you want to marry her, by the time I return her to her parents' house, you cannot go and marry her. Your no, it's not like that. Channel this energy towards retrieving, regaining your business. Which energy? Which, which, which energy, Mama? I don't, I don't like what you're saying. You're channeling to getting your, your, your business. Mama, Mama, you you know, know, I hope there's no problem. There is a lot of problem. Your daughter has told me to be a stranger in my own house. Please calm down. I, I don't I don't need to calm down. I don't need to calm down, Nai. The worst part of it now that she fights me. Your daughter fights me. Are you serious? My own daughter. Look at my face. Do I look as if I was attacked by arm robbers? No. Your daughter did this to me. She did all this to me. You mean my own daughter, Mankemo, did this to you? I will marry no one. 
Abumiri no no. You can call her now. Pick pick your phone and call her. Um. This is unlike her. Hmm. Eh? The Susan that I raised never fought with anyone until she left this house. Eh? She now treats me like a baby. She talks to me anyhow. She treats me like a baby, like a kid. Ajilo. Ajilo Chuk. Please. Um, I think we need to hear from her. You understand? Because the Susan I raised is a very quiet girl. I wonder what turned her into this fighting and abusing people, especially you. We are two good friends. What happened? Come on. We need to hear from her. Because the Suzanne I raised is a very quiet girl. She can't do this. Please, just take it easy until we hear from her. All right? I'm sorry for what happened. Please. I'm sorry. Okay. Come and sit down. It's okay. I don't want to sit down. I don't want to sit down. Go, sit down. No, please. no, no, it's okay. We are not, we are not quarreling. We are not quarreling. We are not fighting. It is not funny. It's not funny. Look at my face. Look at my face. Look at my face. My brother here, who has changed completely. You must be out of your mind. I don't understand. Uh, oh, wait, Susan. <laughs> you called my brother to vindicate you? Why won't I? Eh? Oh yes, why won't I? Since you lost your business, this woman here took up your responsibilities. She's the one that has been taking care of your family. Yet you have the mind, I mean, have the cause to lay your hands on her. Come on, are you being fair? I thought as much. I knew the daughter I raised. I'm a mama. Mama, you, you believe him? If I don't believe your own brother, who else will I believe? <clears throat> I know you as a good person. I understand the fact that when a man is not as he expected to be, it always affects his mindset. But I tell you what, a man can fall seven times and get up and dust and move on. So you need to put yourself together and move on, please. Beating your wife will not solve anything. The best you should do is to make better plans and move on with your life forward again. But you know, Chuku, like I said before, you need to put your self together and move on. I don't want to hear this story from both of you. Please. Thank you. Bye now.
Hachi Ochuko. You need to calm down. You need to take things easy. I say if you care. <sighs> okay, fine. I need us to talk about this. It seems staying at home always makes you feel bad and bored. I would advise that you go with me to the shop. The main shop, the one on Bank Road. At least that will keep you out of the house and then you know you you know my going out and my coming in as well. When I suggested that to you, you declined. Ajilo, I didn't think you were serious about it, but now that I'm saying it, would you want it or not? been bored all by myself. Oh. Mm. <laughs> You're missing me, eh? Honestly, I have. <laughs> At a point, I wanted to come to your office. Honestly. Uh, you wanted to come to my office? Yes, babes. To do what? <sighs> of course I was bored. And I was missing you as well. Oh. Mm. But on a serious note, darling, I need to get something doing. I mean, I can't sit all day all by myself here. I told you I need to get a shop. Yeah, I remember what I told you. I just don't want you to go into all this petty, petty business, <sighs> selling biscuits, popcorn, all those small scale business. I want you to do something that is creative, something that is very, very substantial. Something that when you hit like this, money will come out once. My love, that is the hmm? same thing you said the last time I told you I needed five million to open something big. Please. It's okay. I don't want to stretch this anymore. I'll give you five million. No problem. Sorry, I think I uh, I got something in my ears. No. I, I didn't hear you. I'll give you five million. Shut up! Oh my god! <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, thank you. It's okay. I'll give you tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. Yeah, tomorrow. What, what can I say? Okay. To show you how much I appreciate this, mm -hmm. I want to show you something upstairs. Why not come to the room so I can say thank you? I need to say thank you in the room. Uh -uh. Can we go in? <laughs> I need you to relax your muscles. Yeah, no so relax everything. I'll give you a massage. <laughs> I could get him, I need to take care of him.
Uh -huh. Hi. How are you and how is it? Please call me Fever. So I called you to, to introduce you to our new staff. You? Oh. What is air? No, I want to understand. What do you mean by air? Nothing. Nothing. He will be working here with us. Okay? That will be all for now. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay. What is air? What were you thinking? Oh, in your head, I'm going to leave this whole shop for you to handle. You couldn't even handle small business. Your own business. You want me to leave mine for you to handle. So that you will kill it the same way you killed your business. Eh? And let that woman pick that bag if that is what she wants. I can't believe Mada could be doing this to her own husband. Hey! Why could she be doing that to her husband? For me, I don't believe that man is her husband. Says with me. That man is, is her husband. I know him too well. That man has been scammed from all the money he had. He used to have on you. He was scammed. He lost everything. Please, once I told you, please. No wonder she's treating me like this. Hi, women. Okay, this is not what I asked you. I said indigo color. Madam, we don't have indigo color. Give me yellow. We don't have indigo color. Since we don't have it, then you can drop this one now. Uh -huh. No, my brother, stop telling me nonsense. I said we don't have indigo. Which one is indigo color? What are you indigo in? We don't have indigo white. color. I don't want white. I need indigo color. We don't have indigo. Uh -uh. Don't give me yellow. Then keep it now. Madam. 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 Indigo color. Give me uh, indigo. Uh, I'm sorry, okay? It's okay. Just oh, calm down. She will attend to you, alright? She will get you indigo color. Oh? Olga? Excuse me. I want to see you inside. She will attend to you. Thank you. Oh, I said I want to see you. Do you know what was the meaning of that? Why were you embarrassing my customer like that? Can you ah? You didn't hear me. But from the look of things, you know that she I don't think she's ready to buy anything. See ya. Oh, you could see her pockets to know that she was. Le, I did not bring you here to embarrass my customers. You said you wanted to work, and that is the reason I brought you to this place. Can't you convince a customer? Eh? If you speak to every customer that walks in here to get something, who will come back here to buy something? You want to form my business? Biko, do do do, ejimchuku wey yogi. If you don't want to work, why let me go home and stay? Don't come and spoil business for me. Ah, you know, we discuss this now. You said you wanted to work and that is why I brought you here. The simple thing you would do is to convince a customer to buy something and leave. Not to shout at them. But we don't have indigo. She said that she's looking for indigo. Eh, uh, and don't have indigo. She said she's looking for indigo. And you told her that we have digo. You know what digo? Anoma Jogi, what is digo? Digo is okay. Hey, please, please, please. Let me hear something. Simple thing you would have told her to get another color. It is that simple. Common mathematics. That's why you failed. Uh, madam, please. Hey! No, this is not good. This is not happening. I reject this in Jesus' name, Father Lord. In fact, let me be the last man that will be in this condition. Yeah. Because of indigo. Mac indigo. Darling, listen, you know how 
I do it to you. I am ready to give you hearts and make you scream to the heavens. <laughs> <laughs> You're very naughty, really. No, but truly, I miss you. And yeah. I just wish I could come over right now. <laughs> mm, darling. You know what I can do? I swear I can wait to make you go crazy. I mean, bust your head. I wish I could just be with you right now. I I don't know, there's just something about you that is so, so different. Very different. <sighs> really, you want to. You know one super thing about you is that um, the experience I have with you is different from what I have gotten from my husband since I got married to him. I mean, there's just, there is something special and different about you. Mm. I like the sound of that. <laughs> wow. I love you so much. Aww. I love you too, baby. Oh, I take care, darling. Real soon. You'll see me very soon. I love you. I will see you today, okay? Honestly, I'm not surprised. I would have been even more worried if she has no man out there. I mean, it's not possible for a woman to turn blank on her husband if she has no replacement elsewhere. My eyes have seen my ears. I tell you, I don't know what to do. Who do I offend? Eh? This is not the question you're supposed to be asking right now. I think you should be asking yourself the way forward. That should be the best thing. What, what way forward? Please just tell me that you're... All you need to do right now is to put yourself together and think of the way forward. Yes. So what do you mean? You have allowed darkness to be cloud your mind. All you know how to think best is how to take your own life. But don't always forget. There is hope for the living. Yes. There is. I've lost all hope. Where is the hope? Mm -hmm. huh? First, you need to think of it and believe it, you will never fail again. Secondly, go to Onicha, say that your land, and use the money to. Set up something good for you. You set up your own business. Selling the land in Onitra is not the issue. That's the only land left. Okay? Okay, that one. I have a child. What if I sell this land and use the money for the business and the business fails? What would be the fate of that boy? <laughs> Now I've seen you have lost your sense of business. Ajulu, do you know that risk taking is the mother of business? Let's say if you still leave the land and your wife sell it after you might have died and give the same money to her boyfriend. Have you ever think of that? Um, um, 
Hayır bu. You really need to add fast. Hajulu. You really need to do something before you start losing your mental strength. I am beginning to believe seriously that Hajulu Chuku is under serious spiritual manipulation. I mean, whoever is doing this to him wants to make sure that he loses everything he has gotten in life. That will not happen. I won't let that happen while I'm still alive. I mean, if we let him sell the land and he squanders the money like he always does, what do I tell my son when he grows up? I mean, that's the more reason you should take this very seriously. Oh, yes. Angelo, Angelo Chuku was never like this. I mean, what happened to him? How did he get to this point? I don't know what's true. Why do you want to sell? Sell your only inheritance. I have told my story. Loud and clear. And even the deaf has heard me. See, I've chosen to stop complaining to them. Or rather, let me carry my cross. It is my life. Brother, not by selling your only land. I mean, can't you think of something else to do? I don't need your advice. Or your opinion. Just let me be. See, brother, calm down. See, calm down. You see, I can support you. What is it you want to do? Come up with it. I can support you, right? I mean, you can start up something and you pick it up from there. <laughs> you can support me. Oh, yes, you're my brother. Wow. That's good. <laughs> I used to think that you're still my brother. Of course. But change. they say that when a man is rich, everybody becomes his brother. He is my brother. He is my blood, my ally, because he's too rich. But when he's broke, everybody becomes a helper. <laughs> I supported you. I did everything for you to make sure you are good. I never requested for anything in return. But now, it is my time. You left me. You left me! Now you sound like an ingrate. I have supported you countlessly. And here you are talking rubbish. All because you want me to support you in condemning your innocent wife who has shouldered your responsibility single-handedly. Now, brother, if that is what you want me to do to show you I support you, then it's unfortunate. You need to rethink. Unfortunately, I don't want your support. Look at you. You are looking good. A lovely dress. But please, let me be. I don't want your support. If I want to perish, so be it. Sita <sighs> I've been trying every possible means to get a buyer. All you need to help me do is for look for a buyer. Help me out, look for buyers. All my friends have been contacting to buy this light. They seem not interested. Yeah? 
I need to sell this land. Let me solve this problem once and for all. Come on, help me. Talk to your friends now. Adjola, you see, I have told you times with that number. Calm down. Be calming down. You know you come back to me later. Keep trying. And I will go home and do the same. I will try and talk to some people on how we can get the buyer as soon as possible. Please. Please, I need it as soon as possible. I need to sell this land. Please. Adieu. Come and have a seat. Please. Relax your mind. Come and have a seat. Man, this is now. Yeah, now, body miss you. As in, I'm, I'm going crazy, man. Please be calm down. Adjulo, at this point, I want you to stay away from your wife. So that she won't know your next plan. And I want to let you know after selling this land, I don't want this money to stay in your hand, even more than a week. But I've told my wife already. She's aware of it. She knows about it. But you know you shouldn't have told her. You should have kept it hidden from her. <laughs> Tabo. <clears throat> my wife will not do anything. Hmm? Let's forget about that one. She will not do jack. Please, look for people that will buy this land. Let me move on. I need to move on. I will, but you just have to be careful with your wife. You know, at this point, you don't trust her. Be very careful. She won't do anything. Forget about that woman. Please. Okay, I will do my best. So, what is the job? Oh, yes. Listen, I am tired. My husband is bent on making my life miserable. The man doesn't even want me to have a moment of happiness. I really don't know what he wants. But that is why I'm here. So tell me, darling, what kind of happiness do you want now? Mm -hmm. You mean you... Sorry. I have a call. It's a business call. Um, hello? No, I need you to make sure that he pays the full money before you give him the goods. Listen, I don't want down payment. Full money or nothing. And make sure he doesn't leave that place with my goods if he doesn't have the money with him. I mean the whole money. All right, give me a call when you guys are done. Okay, call me. Yes, boss. Mm. <laughs> uh, so what type of happiness do you want to give me? <sighs> Seriously, I am tired. I don't even know what is wrong with that man. <laughs> His brothers even had to talk to him into selling the land, but the idiot refused. If I may ask, how much is he going to gain from selling the land? That land is in one of the most strategic positions in Onicha. I heard someone was around to buy it some years ago and was pricing for 10 million naira. And he refused. I'm sure that land is worth more than 10 million naira now. So that's a lot. Ten what? Ten million naira. <sighs> well, uh, if you ask me, I think it will be better for him to leave the land. At least for your son's legacy. Did I hear you say legacy? <laughs> Which legacy? I'm thinking of using the land for something better in our college. What, what legacy? I have my plans. Good plans. 
So I don't even need him to sell it because he's still going to sell it and end up using the money for a failed business. So. And I'm very sure I'm part of that plan. Mm -hmm. Show me why I should put you in the plan. Well, I'll show you. Really? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. Okay, okay. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I just got here. <laughs> Can I at least get a drink first? Oh, God. Drink today. <laughs> I am the drink. <laughs> Yes, Gina. Uh, Daddy is getting ready to start up his business again. Wow! I'm happy to hear that, Dad. <laughs> you know what? I want you to make money so Mom will stop, will stop shouting at you. Mm. Come on, my boy. It's okay. Very soon, Daddy will bounce back and I'll make you proud. You know I love you so much. I love you, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, mm -hmm. I would like to travel with you. Oh, okay. This is a business trip. By the time I'm back, then we'll go on vacation. Okay, hmm? Dad. Give me five. That's my boy. Junior, how are you? I'm fine, Mom. Thank you. Why don't you come and say hi to me? Thank you. You need to go upstairs now. I got you something. It's been taken to your room already. Okay? Okay, mom. All right. And don't make noise. Hmm? Yeah. Ajulu. I have made vacant the office of the manager at my branch office. I would want you to resume there. I mean, start working there for now. Oh, okay. Um, I'm sorry, I'm not interested. I told you that before, but you refused. Well, I have accepted now. I even had to demote the manager there, so you can start working there. Oh no, you can promote him back again. I am not interested. Oga, what is your problem? No, I'm asking you, what is your problem? I know exactly why you're doing this, because you want to sell that land. Why do you insist on selling that land? But the land belongs to me. That's my land. And nobody will stop me from selling it if I want to. Now listen to me and listen good. Over my dead body. Quick my lips. Over my dead body would you sell that land? Then you get ready to die. Yes. Because I will sell the land and nothing will happen. You will die a poor man. That's bad. You will continue cleaning it until you die. This one is wife. Hmm? If they call wife now, this one will come out. This one is wa. They don't come out since. Useless woman, baby. Woman without respect. A wu. is a I beg you. The wife will come here. Match out. more than 15 million. That land is, normal price for that land in the market is 30 million. But because of the uh, working man, so I just started to like sell it all. That's the last price I can get. The last, yeah, 15 million, yeah. Ajolo. Okay. Okay, okay, no problem. Over now. Ajolo! Thank you. 
Mama, I'm, I'm on call now. Uh -uh. Yeah? What are you doing here? When did you even come back? Tell me that what I just heard is not true. What is not true? Mama, anything, if you hear anything about me, it's true. Ajilujiko. I'm telling you the truth now. Anything, if you hear anything about me, Mama, eh? It's true. Yes. If you hear now that your son is dead, Mama, it's true. Huh? Ajuli, you now hear that Ajuli is climbing tree somewhere. Mama, you don't need to confirm anything from anybody or call, call me to confirm. Mama, it is true that Ajuli kill somebody somewhere. Mama, it is true. You need to believe it. Don't call for confirmation at all. Mama, please, you people should leave me alone. Uh-uh. Ajuli, nah, are you okay? Uh-uh. I'm not okay. Happen them. Uh-uh. Ajuli. I'm a minus one now. Happen them. You should leave me alone. Ajuli, ma'am. I can't hold it. I hold it, Mama. I'm not. I'm not feeling well. I'm not okay. Hi, Nirumbo. Hi, my enemies. My enemies have come. How? Chimonye mere wam. Ajulo. Ile kukuari ke wu mere wam. Ajulo. Ajulo, come and sit down. Uncle, I want to stay here. You want to sit? You want to stay there? Yes. So. Why would anybody want to sell his only inheritance? Mm -hmm. Why? Uh -huh. Ask him. Ask him. Nam Jukeni Ajolo. Answer. Why do you want to sell your inheritance? You can only use what you have to get what you want. If only free. Ajolo Chuku. That's a very big risk. <sighs> My brother. If you ask me, I will tell you it hasn't gotten to that. There are so many other avenues through which you can raise money. Yes. Hmm? I've made up my mind. So there's nothing anyone can do about it. I need to move on. I've made up my mind. Hey! Ajuluchuku. 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 How many times have I called you? Just, just call three times. Be calmer than that. Hmm. Oh, dear Romo. Oh, Chico. Hello? Yeah. Okay, this is Andrew Chuku Chuku Chuku. In general. Huh? Uh, I'm doing the land. land. There's no problem, no problem. Yeah, I want to sell it here. No problem. Okay. That's the amount. Okay, thank you. Bye. Why? Why are you doing this? Hi! My enemy is so hi! Isn't it? You can go inside. Hmm. We are here to advise him. Since he doesn't want to listen to any of us. Let him do whatever that pleases him. He's old enough to make his own decisions. My brother, let us leave. Ajulu, just do whatever that pleases you. No problem. Hi. Ajulu. Ajulu. Ajulu! Mama. No, Mama. Back on, back on, tap, but you hear me, oh? Back on, Traveled. Yes, that I've traveled. Um, did he by any means tell you where he was traveling to? No, ma. 
He never told me, but I I overheard him on phone talking to someone. He said he was traveling to the village. Um, it's okay. And you go back to what you're doing, but be careful so you don't drop anything. Okay. okay. I can conquer this beautiful body of yours. I can't believe it's just but a feeling. Mm. And um, if you were to be a flower, you know what? I will plant you right outside my door so that I could foster you every day of my life. And you could love me forever. Have I told you that your beauty has imprisoned me more than once? When I think of your gaze, I feel dizzy, bewitched by your beauty. It took my mother years to make me a madman. A madman for you, actually. <laughs> and take me to where the rainbow ends. I'm all yours. Of course. I will do just that. Hey, 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 hey,
that's messed up. That's all that's so messed up with doing the blush. Okay? So I advise you using the other one over there. Oh. Okay, then. Of course. I'll use this. Get started. Sex and all the care you give to me. I need a home. If I was your brother, won't you be expecting that by now I, I should be married and probably with kids? Look at you. You're married and you live with your husband. But I'm here all by myself. No wife, no kids. How long do you expect me to be living like this? I am the only son of my parents and they want this even more than the money I send back to them. Why didn't you tell me this this whole time? But you four people should have known that I have come of age. I need a home I can call my own. Listen to me. We can build this home together. Ken, I love you. You shouldn't be doing this to me. I don't wish for that either. But you're taken. No. No, I, I'm not taken. Ken, I, I want to be with you. Listen, I, I could sell off all my assets and we can be together. I love you, Ken. And what do you expect people to say about that? Take a good look at me. Does it look like I care what anybody says or thinks? Ken, we can go somewhere, somewhere far from here, where nobody knows us. You. Susan, are you sure this is what you want? If only this is what you want as well. 
then I am 100% ready. Of course, yes. <laughs> this is what I want. Adjulo, hmm. one week is too close. Give or take two or three weeks. I will drive for me. But if you're lucky, then you see before the two weeks or the one week, I will give you a call. It's okay. Yeah. It's a good place. I like it. Good. Good. It's cool. You really need to put more effort. Because right. we need the money as soon as possible. Alright. You'll have for me. Thank you. Thank you. Listen attentively. Henceforth, I want to be pre informed on every dealing on that land. Wow. Until it is sold. Oh, God, I don't understand. I don't know who you are. Who are you? Yes. I don't know. Well, if you choose to be my friend, I'll give you one million. But if you choose to be my enemy, Mecca! Pardon! I'm very sure we have an understanding now. Have a good day, my friend. I like your land. The land is big, it's good. But provided the documents are intact. Yeah, everything is intact. It's my land. And uh, I'll go to sign after signing before I make any transaction. No problem. It's okay. 
I hope there is no second buyer, third buyer. Don't worry. It's with C of O now. No problem. It's my very good friend. <laughs> No, the power. land is legit. Okay. I know this man very well. If he said the land is legit and uh, the sea of with you, no problem. And then let's go and sign. Right, STDs. Four different sexually transmitted diseases are in this body. This body you're looking at. Hmm. Four different STDs in your body. Four. Then you should start treatment. I wish. Ken, I wish I can start treatment. Ken. HIV is included. What? Okay. Oh man, I'm so, so done. That's all right, come on, sit down. Okay? Could I be so stupid? Josh. Josh. Sit down. Oh. oh shit. Okay. I'm a HIV positive person. Oh my I think you need to calm down. Look at look at how you say it as if it's nothing. Okay, I'm HIV positive. Ha <sighs> You have to calm down. You can't do that. What do you what do you what do you intend to do? 
kill yourself. Uh, I'm already dead. Listen, there are so many people carrying this disease all over the world. Okay, and they're still living. Okay, it's as bad as it sounds. This is HIV. How could I, how could I be so? Josh, they are not living to go and die. <sighs> All you have to do is do exactly what your doctor asks you to do. And take your medication, that's all. Okay. And you live as long as you you are supposed to live on it. Okay. Okay. okay, don't tell me it's alright, please. I don't want to hear alright. I don't just want to hear alright now. I don't just want to hear alright. For here, so anything we will talk, you can, we need to will tell you that you could just do it. They have me. We have say you sell one land. And what about 30 million? Which land? You they ask me which land? I don't sell any land. I don't sell any land at all. Hey! Hey! You didn't say who they play? Hey, hey, hey. Eh? Okay, okay. See, okay. make I tell you. Okay, don't no shoot, don't no shoot. Make I tell you something. If you get anybody where you won't call, call! Don't no shoot now. Okay, I go call my friend. I go I go send the money to my friend account. You go bring him out. You go send him out. You go bring him out. Don't no shoot. No shoot. No shoot now. The, the money no reach 30 million. No, How much? No, 15 million they, they, they pay though. You no reach 30 million. 15 what? 15 million. 15 million? That, that's what they pay.
husband away from me. What do I do? I, I don't even know what to do. I'm finished. Where do I find him? I told Arjuna not to sell this land, but he wouldn't listen. Now see! Baby, baby, can you just stop? You're making the whole thing worse. Susan, please, just stop, okay? Remember you have a son to take care of. Stop crying. For my, I cannot calm down. I can't find my husband and you're asking me to calm down. Because he's being stubborn. Being unnecessarily stubborn. Now see! I'm traveling to go and meet daddy. Yes, 
We're actually going for a vacation. But mom, we're not on holiday. Virginia, please. I don't have time for your endless questions right now. I hope your bags are packed. Yes, mom. Okay, mom. Hi, darling. Hello. Hi. I'm fine, um. Junior. Where are we? Um, this is our new home. Okay, let's go. This is our new home. Yeah. Mom, I wish you don't stay long here because our house is finer than this one. Um. Yes, um, that's true. Our house is finer than this. But guess what? We will be leaving for Canada from here. Wow! I love Canada. I can't wait to be there. Yes, we love Canada. We can't wait to get there. And the thing is, our boxes in the car. So we need to get it, alright? Okay. <laughs> I'll help you get that. Hey. You know, the say a man who sees a snake under his bed needs no sleep. Well then, I think we should seize this beautiful opportunity to be together forever. You know, I... I know I never loved this man, but I never wanted him dead. I mean, what would people think? What do you think we should do? What do I do now?
work with me. Come. Beautiful, you know. Let us run. Yes. You can sell off all your assets. Raise money and we can go to Canada and live a better life there. I even went over to her house the other day to check up on her. After knocking for almost an hour, not even the gate man came to answer me. Babe, don't you think she will be in the village? I don't think so yet. You know, maybe I'll still go to her office to check up on her. Oh, poor woman. Seriously, I pity her. Yes, I pity her because she has gone through a lot. I just hope she's fine wherever she is. I don't even know what to think. Oh, please. Don't tell Mama about this. Because she would definitely lose her senses if she gets to know about all this stuff. Babe, come on. You don't expect me to tell Mama. I mean, she would just faint. She would die. No, come on. I can't tell her. I will never think of that, all right? Maybe uh, I'll just talk to one or two elders. I mean, people I, who I know can keep a secret. Baby. Yes. You can't trust anybody. You can't even trust yourself. Tomorrow you'll decide never to do something and the next time you, you'll find out you've done it. You will see yourself doing it. Don't trust anybody. I'm scared the others might tell, tell her and you know what, what the result will be. Please, I don't know. It's fine, honey. Hey, darling. Oh, hi, Dad. What are you waiting for? Our thoughts. Great news. Listen. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, uh, check this out. I discovered. So I told him about everything we wanted to sell. Okay. And they are ready to buy. Wait a minute. Including the shops? Everything, darling. What? <laughs> okay, okay, but you need to tell them to pay immediately. You know I can't go out anymore. I don't want anybody to see me. Darling, as we speak, they are ready to pay ASAP. Wow. As long as you accept their terms and conditions. <laughs> Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Not to worry, I need to go and change up so that we could go see them. I am freaking ready. <laughs> fast, baby, fast, baby. <laughs> Yeah. 
Yeah, um, where is the madam? Where is Susan? I don't know anybody called Susan. I don't get it. Like, I mean, the owner of this shop? Uh, no, Susan owns this place. I actually work for one Mr. Abdul Ahmed. He is the current owner of this place. I don't get it. But you mean this place has been sold? I don't know about that. All I know is that I work for a man called Ahmed, and that's my boss. He owns this place. Ah. Susan. How can Susan sell? No, no, no. This Susan I know cannot. Cannot. Is there a problem, sir? Yes. Uh, no. No. Uh, okay, that, thank you very much. Eh? Uh, you don't need anything? No, no, no. Sorry, how may I help you? I don't understand that person. I should be asking you that. This is my brother's house. So, how may I help you? The ownership of this house changed three days ago. You can call to make inquiries. I don't get it. I mean, who changed the ownership of my own brother's house? Um, excuse me, sir. Please, we don't have time for this. Um, we have something important doing inside. Please, you can take care of it. Okay. You wait for me now. You can go. Please, we're busy. Please, sir, you can go. Make your inquiry, sir. hearing she has sold the house and the companies too and nobody knows her whereabouts i knew it actually was saying it but she didn't believe him now look at it just look at it now this is the wrongest time for you to say it. i mean i'm just thinking of going to the father's house to check if she's dead that's what i want to do now serious. Sometimes I wonder why the truth gets to come out when the damages has already been made. Like, You mean she did all that? Yes, 
ce moment. Aïe. So where is she now? She's nowhere to be found. She ran away with Junior. Ha. Hey, where is that Julia, brother? He's hiding. He's hiding in one of his friend's house. Actually said it. Your brother said it. Take me there. I want to go and see him. No, Mama. He said he doesn't want to see him. Angelo said this. He was complaining. But we didn't believe him. We didn't even know that the pen was his wife. Hi! Why am I alone? Did nothing happen to my son, God, please. Did nothing happen to my son. Is everything all right? Where is your daughter? You're welcome. Is everything all right? I said, where is your daughter? I have been calling her for days now. She has not been picking up my calls. Where could she have been? Have you checked her house and her office? Of course. But I couldn't see her. She has sold my brother's house and closed down her businesses. Eh? Eh, uh, well. Why would she do a thing like that when it's not even more than two weeks her husband died? Well, I, I, I just hope it is not what I'm thinking. I just hope and wish and pray it is not what I'm thinking. Because I don't know why all these things are happening at this time. If it's what I'm thinking, trust me, sir, I will not take it lightly. I will not take it lightly. Read my lips. Mark my words. I'm not joking. Nani, they will be behaving as if we know the whereabouts of our daughter. I don't know. Eh? 
I wonder what he's thinking. Isn't he the one that we should ask about our daughter? I don't know where she is. How are you? No, no, ma'am. Uh -uh. Darling, mm. I'm happy we have everything we need to survive in Canada. <laughs> mm. Listen, I am happier. I can't wait to be in Canada with you. I mean, just the two of us, happy together. My heart is filled with joy. <laughs> Same here, darling. So have you um, confirmed the payment for the car? Of course I have. I thought I told you, I showed you. Ah, don't mind me. I just want to be sure everything's on check. You know, I don't want to go outside again. I'm very sure they're looking for you out there. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry. Everything is fine. Same way you are on check. You know, I check on you always. <laughs> you know, you are on check. <laughs> of course. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, don't, don't do that, uh, right? Oh! Junior! How are you? Mom, where is my daddy? Um... Listen, daddy will meet us in Canada, okay? Mom, call him on phone. I want to talk to him. Of, of course, that's um, not a problem. I'll just get my phone. <sighs> so, um, let's call Daddy. I told you not to call me until I call you. Now listen, I want you to go to that place. Don't let anyone know where you're going to. Okay? We'll leave this country before they know it. Okay. I will call you soon. Alright, bye. Calling Daddy. Come, let's sit down. Um, unfortunately, um, Daddy's line is not connecting. But you know what? We'll, we'll call him later. Okay? Mom, are you sure Daddy is fine? Yes. Did you hear anything? I have this feeling. I will never see my daddy again. <laughs> that is not true, Junior. Why won't you see your daddy? I just said daddy will meet us in Canada. 
okay? So you would see daddy, all right? Thank you, promise. Yeah. <laughs> pinky promise. <laughs> so now you got a pinky promise. So you're happy. <laughs> you're happy, right? You are happy. Are you happy? Are you happy now? You are happy, right? <laughs> Where are you running to? Come here. <laughs> It is a pity we're meeting like this for the first time. My sincere apologies. You're a very handsome man. Unfortunately, you are not photogenic. Do you know that your wife is the sweetest thing I have ever known? Not just in bed, cash wise also. I see I've got your attention. <laughs> How long will you continue to be living on another man's world? Look at you. A full grown man like you. Sleeping with another man's wife. And you think you're living life. You think I'm afraid of you. I'm not afraid of you. You must be stupid. You should be ashamed of yourself. <laughs> I like this one. I like this one. Take him away from here and kill him. My son was complaining, but we never believed him. Hi! Hey. The heartbreaking thing is that, as I'm talking to you now, nobody knows her whereabouts. Ah! What? Omega. But have you reported to the family? I am just coming from their place now, and the parents claimed ignorant of her whereabouts. As your child. Hmm. That is a very big lie. They must provide her. We must find her. Even if we can't get the properties, we must get a Jewish holy child. Yes. I will do all I can to track her down. Yes. I want my son back home. And I want him safe. Here, me call Be gone. A is not a child. Hi. He will reform me. Please, no need of going inside. Okay? I want us to go and look for what happened to our brother. Yes. From the time his business started having problems, his wife's business started doing well. It is obvious that woman is not clean. So we can't sit and watch her do such wickedness and go scot free. Ah! Arrow. It's a taboo. We can sit and watch evil grow like grass right before us. We must consult the gods. Yes. And ask them questions. And they must give us answers. Uh, my elders, please. You need to calm down. Okay. 
You see, it has not gotten to the point of going to any oracle or deity or shrine. Mm -hmm. in, in this family, we are, we are all Christians. Yes. Right? So, I, I know there are better ways to handle this. I'm a Christian mother. I can't go to any shrine because it's against my belief. Who can last up on the answer? Please. We don't need your permission to do this, woman. We have to let you know. We must find out what happened to our brother. Yes. If only I can, I can see my son and ask him for forgiveness for not believing in him. Oh, and if I can set my eyes on my son. Hi! Hi! Mama, please. Please, it's okay. You see, my elders, like I said before, we don't need to go to any shrine. Yeah? <sighs> I have reported this to appropriate authorities and I'm, I'm sure and I'm positive they will come out with something meaningful. There could be nothing meaningful than that of Okuju. Yes! Or is there something you're not telling us? Eh? Baby, please, can I have a minute of your time? Babe, I... I don't like the way you sounded when the elders came to tell you. They wanted to go to the native doctor to find out what happened to Archulo. You should have supported them. Did you say that? Baby. I mean, did I hear you correctly? Honey, you know your people. We know your people. I'm not surprised they may start thinking you, you have your hand in what happened to your brother. Baby, you shouldn't have stopped them. There is a whole lot going through my head now. Like, I have a whole lot bothering me now. Let me be. Honey, please. You know I love you very much. I... I don't want anything to... to spoil your name. Please, honey. Just listen to me. You know, if you had helped your brother the last time, he wouldn't have disappeared. But you didn't. Baby, look. The truth, they say, is bitter. If you had supported your brother financially and spiritually, I mean, he wouldn't have gone missing. Things wouldn't be going this way. Honey, please. I don't want people to start talking. I don't want them to stain your name. Really, honey, please. I'm not even surprised if they have started talking about it. Baby, if your brother is dead now, I mean, you would spend a million naira plus or even more for his burial. What's the need? Baby, please just support them to get what happened to Achuru, please. Your name is Stake. I don't want anything to happen. You know I love you, honey, please. This has been searching, and up until now, they found nothing. I mean, he is nowhere to be found. Okay, so what about Tabo? They had to let him go. Why do? I mean, he was the person that reported the kidnap, 
And for that, he's a prime suspect. Why let him go? The police investigated him and realized he was innocent. Really? Yeah, he even had to take it to the person that bought the land. Moreover, the kidnappers never contacted anybody. Okay, all right, now what do we do? I'm sure you do. I hope it's not all these chips. Okay. Hold on, please. Come here. I don't know the language you understand. But you have told you this before. I I like you. I, I like your personality. I like who you are. I like the man you have grown to become. You're respectable. You're from a humble home. But um, if you ask me, I would say we should forget about this marriage. I'm not just cut out for this. something money can buy. Love is priceless. I know that love is priceless, but in this case, I'm ready to throw in anything just to make you comfortable, make you happy, as in make you feel like a woman. Thank you. Thank you for loving me and thanks for all the beautiful things you intend to do for me. But, um, I would rather we remain friends. I'm more comfortable as well. I I have to go. Um, I'll call you when I Hi.
I know he gave you a huge amount of money and you collected it from him as well. It needs to stop. You need to stop collecting things from him, Mama. I can't be with him. I like him, but Mama, I'm not ready to marry this man you're talking about. You guys are putting me under pressure and I don't like it. Mama, I said I don't like it. Just stop collecting things. There is nothing to think about. And I don't think I'll ever be. understand how you feel. Honestly, I feel your pain. Please forgive us. Find a place in your heart and forgive us. I'm begging you. How long will it take for a broken heart to heal? Ajay, as long as you allow the past of your mind, you will heal. It's not easy. I know. Forgive us. Please. Oh, wow. But you have to try, my brother. See, I have also decided to raise you 10 million naira. You know, to support you in any business you want. I can also, as well, assist you to, you know, invest it rightly. So see that you go back to your feet. I forgive everybody. I will not forgive you. If you can trust a stranger more than your own blood blood, tell me what is left. All the money you gave her. There is. That is why I had to run to a friend. Who took me to the hospital instead of coming to you, my brother. I don't need your money. Keep your money to yourself. I don't want to see you. Please, just, just forgive my husband. You're right with your blame. But please, let's, let's continue living as one family again. Please, just forgive me. I do not want anything. Yes, I know you hurt me. Actually, please. Actually, please. Don. What's going on? I wonder who's still keeping the taxi man I called. She needs to get a car. We're running late. Look at the time. I don't want us to miss our flights. Oh yes, I think I just get a new one. We don't have all day. 
I'll be back. an hour since he left here. Can't even be possible. It can't be possible. Yeah. Junior. Mom, call his number. I don't want us to miss our flight. That's exactly what I should do. It's not connecting. It's switched off. What have I done I'm a, wrong? I'm a woman like you. Just calm down. Nothing wrong. Leave my mom alone. No, not worry. Nothing mom. is wrong. No, my mom. Come, you are going with your mom. Come, don't worry yourself. No. My Lisa, boy, you, you have a police van here. What have I done wrong? Police van, is it not our vehicle? I haven't done anything. It's all of us vehicle now. Don't worry yourself now. Eh? Don't worry yourself. There's no problem. Madam, at least tell me what the no, problem is. No, there's no problem. There's no problem. No problem. Madam, I've never been to the station before. No I don't worry. That house is for everybody. It's not for one person. Ken! Stop calling Ken. Enter. It's just a little problem. When you get to the station, we settle it. Ken! Get inside. Get inside. Don't worry yourself. Go with your mom. Stop crying. Come, come.
Ajilochuku. I remembered you came to my house and I gave my daughter hand in marriage, which you assured us that you are capable enough to take care of her. And now here you are telling us another different story. What's going on? Nay. If you know what your daughter did to me, you will be hiding your face in shame. In fact, you should be ashamed of raising a monster as a child. Angela Chukwu, you are insulting me intelligently. I'm not insulting you, I'm just telling you the truth. But I'm, I am putting it to you that you know my daughter's whereabout. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay now. Because I raised my daughter the way she's supposed to be a good wife wherever she goes. Mm -hmm. Now she ran away with my son's money. Do you think we hid her somewhere and came here to play pranks with you? Or you think we are joking? Whatever it is, I want my daughter back. Just the way we handed her hand in marriage over to me. Oh, <laughs> Chagokwe. See, you and your husband are standing this way because the police has not come here to arrest you. <laughs> Tell that girl to bring my grandson back home. Tell her to bring back my son's money. Else, you two will have the police to contend with. Hmm? Yeah. You can. I am not afraid of the police. Sooner or later, you will tell the entire village my daughter's whereabouts. You are talking nonsense. Talking rubbish. Nonsense. Yes, you're talking <laughs> nonsense. We go to. Yeah. We are talking nonsense. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, uh, no? I think so. we sounded so loud and clear, so much that even the deaf can understand this. We go to. Yes. Let's go. Yeah. That one. You have used my daughter for rituals. Yes. Let's go. Please, we are going to work. Oh, but you are going to work. I understand. I don't care for what? My husband son that came back from the city told me that our son was arrested for duping a man's wife, even kidnapped the woman's husband. Hey, but tonight, my son cannot do a thing like that. Why am I a man? Kenneth, I know can never do a thing oh, like that. Oh, when your son came in three months ago and was splashing cash all over the place, what did you do? Maybe you were celebrating with, 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 with him as well. Now, now, what do you mean by that? Kevin, I check what do you mean? Ego success. Success. Success can only be celebrated when it is legit. Hey. When it is normal. If it is not, you cannot be celebrated. Hey. That thing going face is a is, is problem. If they find him guilty, oh. If they don't find him guilty, fine. No, is that what you're saying? Eh? Huh? Kenneth is our son, our son, your son. What's is that what you're saying? We're going for it. <laughs> Instead of you to always be cautioning him, this is what you are, you are saying. Hey, no more. Hey, instead of you to sit back here, let's talk for solution. Let's know how to go and solve this issue. Eh, I'm going so bad, Okay, you two, you face the law too. You have to be a man. 
I don't want to see their presence. Do you know what these people did to me? Do you know? Majulu, my brother, you have to face your problem and conquer them. Face your fears and conquer them. You feel bitter because you think the whole world has failed you. And you draw yourself and the entire world into an ocean of blame. What do you expect from a world that is built on evil? Not from a woman that I love so deep with my blood. That is the point. If love could heal this world, I mean, the love God has for this world would have healed it of the hatred that is flowing in it. Actually, we are made alone. So it is we against the world and the world against us. You have to be careful of every man until your soul departs from your body and is planted into the earth like a seed. I'm alive. Thank God Almighty that touched the heart of one of your boys. Who instructed them not to kill me? That's how the first bullet. See your life. This is the person you chose to end your life with. Look at him. You see that both of you are not normal. Both of you are not normal. Where is my son? Where is my son? Thank <laughs> you. 